For behind-the-scenes access to your favorite stars, sign up for SoPub Insider today. Your General Hospital recap for Monday, August 31st, 2020, features Jason's homecoming, Carly weaving a web of falsehoods, and Alexa suffering a profound loss. Sam's elation at Jason's promise to return to their apartment was hampered by a run-in with Valentine. While Nina stood on the sidelines listening, Sam accused Valentine of raiding ELQ for the sole purpose of ousting Michael from the top spot. When he inquired as to why he would do that, Valentine was reminded that Michael had blackmailed him over his involvement in Sasha's masquerading as Nina's daughter. And as Ava can attest, Valentine does not like being blackmailed. Michael should consider himself lucky that the threat wasn't exchanged while the two were on a balcony. Off her confrontation with the former Cassidyne heir, Sam was heartened to see Jason walking through their front door. And then she had to listen in stunned silence as he recalled the events surrounding his discovery of Taggart. Over at the cliffside cabin, Carly truthfully recounted her brief tussle with Nell, though she left out the part about her rival's literal fall from grace. After her interview with Valerie was concluded, Carly received congratulations on her performance from Jax, but she was still wondering if she had done the right thing. Hoping for a respite from all of the recent drama, Sonny took to turning woods and shared a fleeting moment with his dad. In its aftermath, Sonny assured Mike that he was free to let himself go. Sonny would no longer force him to remain for his own sake. Neil was pleasantly surprised by Alexis's insistence that she didn't want to be just friends. She wanted something more. Much more. He happily accompanied her to the bedroom, and in the afterglow of their lovemaking, the two giddily planned their new futures. At daybreak, Alexis prepared two cups of coffee, but quickly ascertained that all was not well with her bedmate. His feet were ice cold, and he wasn't responding to her calls. General Hospital made its debut on April 1st, 1963, and is the second longest running daytime drama in American history, coming second only to Guiding Light. The show exploded into mainstream popularity in the early 1980s due to its wide-reaching appeal. Daytime Emmy winners Jeannie Francis and Anthony Geary appeared on the covers of Newsweek and People magazine, and started a soap opera craze unlike any that the world had ever seen. Originally created by Frank and Doris Hursley, the show is currently helmed by executive producer Frank Valentini, head writer Chris Van Etten, and co-head writer Dan O'Connor. The Corinthos, Quartermain, Baldwin, Collins, Jerome, and Ashford families drive stories in the show's fictional city of Port Charles. General Hospital has won the Daytime Emmy for an outstanding drama series a record 13 times, and is one of four remaining daytime dramas currently on the air. The other three are Days of Our Lives, The Young and the Restless, and The Bold and the Beautiful. General Hospital airs weekdays on ABC. Check your local listings for airtimes. For products and apparel that show off your love of soaps, visit the Soap Hub shop today.